Good things are happening in Metro Detroit, where cider mill season has arrived with the unofficial start of fall. It's a delicious time of year, my own favorite. Now we're talking to people in several communities who say nothing beats savory treats combined with quality time. 7 News Detroit reporter Christiana Ford talking to people already enjoying fun there as the and the owner of a cider mill who's sharing his excitement. And as you can see, the machine here really does all the work. There's the hole puncher that punches the dough and drops it into the fryer and they come right on this conveyor belt, hot and crisp. Give me a new one. During this time of year, there's one thing on a lot of Metro Detroiters' minds. They look four already. Especially the donuts. Fresh off out the grease of hot and nice. Which cider mill to hit up for the best donuts in cider? I feel like fall is just the perfect season and this is definitely the perfect fall activity. My friends from Bloomfield Hills are paying me money so I can bring them back donuts. And for some, like Ron Zimmerman, who always sits on this bench at Franklin Cider Mill, it's a family tradition. I've been coming here yeah. for about 65 years or 70 years. Hey, look at Addison. The bees are trying to get into my cider. Metro Detroit cider mills are kicking off the season like Franklin Cider Mill in Bloomfield Hills. We are in the middle of a city and a town and that's very unique for cider mills. And I think that we've been around for so long and that every person just wants to always come. They drive by and if they have never been here before, they stop by and they see what the magic is here. And Three Cedars Farm in Northville. It's kind of like a tradition and uh, so we appreciate the people that support our farm here. Expecting plenty of families eager to get their hands on their first bites. And everybody's after that cider and donuts and um, doing the fall tradition. Michigan is known for producing a wide variety of apples, but this is expected to be another above average year for the crop with an abundant harvest. So you always hope it's a good season, but when it's a great season and it's all over the news that the apple crop is great, it only is better for us. It keeps the cost down and of course it's uh, about the ripening of the apples to make sure that you're picking them at the right time and have blended apples to make your cider uh, perfect. Both family owned places that say having good apple crop years and weather is good for business. In Michigan, people go to different cider mills, so they don't just pick one, they just try them all. And there's so plenty kind of, of picking of to do. Are... Christiana Ford, 7 News Detroit. Thank you, Christiana. As we mark the unofficial starts of fall, there's plenty of cider mills for families and friends to visit, including Detroit Farm and Cider, Wired's Orchards in Ypsilanti, Franklin Cider Mill, of course, in Franklin, and Yates in Rochester Hills. Among the favorites, open for the season. How about those donuts and the cider slush? I want to bring my little guy to try them. Oh, yeah, because yeah. he hasn't done that yet, has right. he? No, that would be fantastic. And feeding the ducks with the old stale donuts mm -hmm. that they give you is always fun, too. So.